السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. It is Mohammed Shaban. I am at uh, mosque uh, Riverside Islamic Center, and um, it is uh, Friday, the 28th of August, and um, I've been trying to. Uh, uh, trying to be to keep my sanity <laughs> and uh, I have a lot of to say I have some official threw under the bus I don't know if it's gonna make any difference anyway uh, what is uh, been happening uh, continuing of continuation of committing crimes frauding people out of their benefits and keeping them in the system as accounts and uh, preying on them and uh, and the federal government and Department of Justice and everywhere they doing the same thing you know wider or higher scale uh, it's unbelievable it's corruption pure corruption and injustice to everyone, everyone. There is no, again, there is no one immune, not group of people or uh, ethnicity or religion or what have you. It's everybody is, uh, if they can victimize them, they will, won't hesitate. And again, what I wanted to emphasize here that they are, uh, they think that they have the right to do so and uh, any resistance or even try to bring it to their attention they become very nasty they become you know uh, they they don't like it they're arrogant you know and um, they they're willing to commit every crime wallahi they are and uh, they tell you that they let you know that uh, we we you know we are uh, allow to commit every crime and talking about heinous crimes and uh, <coughs> I wanted just to uh, list the events that took place um, you know the last December the beginning of the month well, I was homeless, and, you know, since I left the, uh, I got evicted from uh, Rancho Santa Margarita. We know that in uh, March 5th, uh, 2014, then moved to uh, Santa Barbara because, you know, a couple of months later or a few weeks later, because the homeless shelter and, uh, you know, the cold weather, the armory in Fullerton, Mercy House was uh, over, and um, I learned or I knew from someone that uh, uh, rescue mission in Santa Barbara uh, downtown, right, right, you know, uh, yeah, downtown Santa Barbara. Uh, they have um, 360 days around uh, shelter. So I went there and I was there for a few months and uh, I faced the same thing and I see the same crimes, you know, and, and uh, you know, keeping people in the status quo so they, they, they you know, the non-profit, and especially uh, actually in Santa Barbara more so than anywhere, but they are friendly though, they are not, uh, uh, you know, there is a lot of service and they give the service, uh, you know, they still, you know, commit the same crimes and violate people's rights and, keep them in the status quo to keep the funds uh, pouring in from the federal government and uh, the, the, uh, the investors and, you know, uh, grants and so on and so forth, you know, and uh, embezzled among themselves and yeah, keep the people, in the, you know, there because if they, there are no recipients, uh, there is no funds. Anyway, came back to Orange County again, and I was still homeless. Which again, I am glad, wallahi I am, 
because if I didn't experience all of that, I wouldn't know what was going on, and I wouldn't be even thinking about having uh, a nonprofit to fight and uh, to, you know to to make a difference for people. And Alhamdulillah, I was you know I was able to do that. Everything is uh, already uh, fair, and uh, I wanted to say some here because you know everyone telling me that I. Assalamu alaikum. How are you? Um, Alhamdulillah. Uh, so everyone telling me that you can't, uh, you can yeah. oh, you get to be grateful that we are here. I am. I am. I am grateful that I'm in the United States of America. And I am grateful that I was able to go, uh, you know, experience all of these things in that time or that period of my life anyway. And I am very grateful that I was able to uh, have the nonprofit and uh, the 501c approved. Uh, so this is all, uh, <laughs> you know, but I don't have to be sitting there and playing the games and take the carrots and just being complacent and don't bring it to their attention that there is uh, a lot of people out there, they can do what I am doing and they, uh, uh, I am willing, uh, you know, I'm taking an initiative to help and I'm putting my money where my mouth is. So, uh, I am saying that because everywhere I go, they say, oh, well, a, a young man uh, work for work for the county of San Bernardino. You know, I met him, a uh, very intelligent young man. And, and, and he seems that he was born here. He's originally from uh, Kuwait. His name is Faisal. I shouldn't say his name, but anyway. And he told me that he went a couple of years to visit uh, Egypt, and he said people are, the children are playing in the sewage, and, uh, you know, it's uh, much better here, and we should be very grateful, you know. And this is exactly what I'm talking about, you know. People are so brainwashed and programmed, and they know exactly, I mean, this, you know, 